are self-defense techniques a woman can use to fend off an attacker. News Channel 3 reporter Lise Martinez shows us what she learned from a local mixed martial arts instructor. At the Paragon Academy in Santa Barbara, instructor Sean Apperson says more young women are taking Brazilian jiu-jitsu and kickboxing in preparation for college life. I have seen a bit of a change where some of the high school parents are bringing their girls in, trying to get them ready when they're 15, 16. Hey, they're a little bit worried. You can tell there's a little bit more concern going on. According to the Centers for Disease Control, 19% of undergraduate women experience attempted or actual sexual assault. Apperson says learning to defend yourself is necessary, but it isn't going to happen in a weekend seminar. If you're at the Shell station at 3 a.m. and someone grabs you, that's not going to work. You have to have, you know, more preparation. The skills are built over time. Then they become second nature. It, it takes a commitment, like learning anything, anything that is uh, complicated and challenging takes doing something on a weekly basis for a good six months to a year. Apperson says women have a fighting chance even if they are smaller than their attacker. Look up and bring your hips forward. And you bring your hips, yeah, almost like you're going to try to pick me up. Some of these girls, after four or five months of training, are actually really starting to do, to do pretty well. And then when new guys come in that are much bigger and stronger, they're able to defend themselves. And they're actually able to get these guys in submission holds and make these guys tap out. We asked him to show us how to fend off an attack from behind. So if I was reaching over your neck, you just lift with your legs, see? And then can I throw you? Now just tilt your shoulders. Here it is again. Grab their arm, squat low, then lower your shoulder and flip. Your attacker is on the ground. But remember, it takes practice. In Santa Barbara, Elise Martinez, News Channel 3. She has some good moves there. A memorial for one of the